Hi, this is Heather from A More Crafty Life. Today I'm going to show you how to make a double thick waffle stitch pot holder. This is an easy pattern using double crochet and front post double crochet to make this textured square. Um, for this pattern, you need two skeins of Reup Recycled Cotton Yarn by Lion Brand or any other worsted weight gauge for yarn in cotton. You'll also need a H five millimeter crochet hook. So let's get started. Okay, for this pot, waffle stitch pot holder, you need to crochet a chain of 32. Um, for the waffle stitch, you need an even number of chains for the pattern. So go ahead and pause and chain your 32. Okay, after your chain of 32, then we're going to double crochet in the fourth stitch from the chain. So one, two, three, four. Okay. And then you're gonna continue and you're gonna do one double crochet for each chain to the end of the row. Okay, when you're done with that, you can pause the video and come back when you're done with that. Okay, so we've reached the end of the row and you just end with a, a double crochet. So it should look like this. Then you're going to chain three and turn and this chain three will be the first double crochet of this row so then you're going to do a front post double crochet and then two regular double crochets so for the front post double crochet you yarn over insert your hook you go behind the stitch yarn over pull up a loop yarn over pull through two loops yarn over and pull through the last two loops. So you'll see how your um, double crochet goes around the stitch instead of in the top like normal. Then you do two regular double crochets, one in each of the next two stitches. Then you do a front post double crochet, yarn over, insert hook, go behind the stitch, yarn over, pull up a loop, yarn over, pull through two loops, yarn over, and pull through the final loops. Followed by one double crochet in each of the next two stitches. And this is the repeat. One front post double crochet, followed by two double crochets. And you do this until you get to the last two stitches of the row. And so pause the video and finish up and I'll meet you. Okay, and when you come to the last two stitches, you're going to do one double crochet in each of the last two stitches of the row. So one double crochet two double crochets. And now if you look at it, you can see that you do a double crochet where you did the front post on the other side, the first row. And then you, where you did two double crochets, you do front post double crochets. So you do the opposite. And then you can start to see how the pattern um, repeats. And then you're going to chain three and you're going to repeat the row before. So you repeat row two and three until you have 19 stitches. And then you can start to see the um, boxes that it makes by the raised stitches. And you can see that here 
on the pot holder. So after you have um, 19 rows is a square, then you're going to make a second one and then you are going to sew the two sides together to make a double thick pot holder. Thank you for watching. Okay, we're down to the last two um, stitches. You're going to front post double crochet in this one, the second from the end, and then in the chain, you're going to do a regular double crochet. Then you're going to chain three, turn your work, and this will be the first double crochet of this row. Then you're going to do one double crochet. Followed by two front post double crochets. So one double crochet followed by two front post double crochets. And that is the repeat for this row. Pause the video and follow it to the end.